Okay, shall we look at um, Amgen? Amgen sold off pretty hard. Um, let's look at Amgen. And I think Amgen reported Q3. I have to look at Numora a little more closely. I spammed the Cassava website, so now I can't. <laughs> I can't go to like most corporate websites because NASDAQ operates most corporate websites and NASDAQ has banned my IP address. Even though I'm a customer of NASDAQ and I have a good relationship with them, it's like an auto, auto ban. All right. Chegg is not done for, no. Chegg is far from done for. That is the consensus. But they still have a ton of revenue. Yeah, I just can't change the VPN while I'm streaming. You guys know I make software for a living, right? All right, so let's see. Epogen 33, Aranesp. 337, you last uh, 110, Enbrel. Where's my Enbrel? 825, Enbrel's falling off a cliff. All right, Tepeza. I don't know why they bought this drug, man. Tepeza 488. I always find it funny when there's a, a drug that has no rest of world sales, it's all US. Christexa, 310. Oblinza, 106. Parsibiv, 70. All right, Vectabix, 282. A little engine that could. All right, Prolia, one of the most important Amgen drugs. 1045, pretty good. Xjiva is just basically Prolia with a different label. That's 541. Oh, Tesla, which will go generic at some point. 564. Evenity. Evenity was definitely better than expected over the course of its launch. Let's see how the quarter was. The quarter was so so. Repatha, doing okay. Repath is doing more than okay. Repath is killing it. No more ammo vig. Um, Tezspire. This is a pretty exciting drug. I actually might take start taking it. Two sixty nine. Already blockbuster now. Amjavita. That's their Enbrel biosimilar. Lumacras. This was like way overhyped. Unfortunately, oh, well, it's starting to pick up a little bit. Very slow. Kyprolis, older drug at this point. Endplate, an older drug at this point. Wow, Endplate's actually decent size. Impressive. Okay, Blincito. That acquisition would. For, Blin for Micromet, worked out really well for Amgen. Blincito is also bra breaking out in revenue. Very impressive. Amgen, so the theory on Amgen is maybe even without the obesity drug, it's undervalued. That's the theory. Shout out to the plug, Mark Andreessen. Vassi 195, Imdeltra. That's 36. Okay. Kanjinti, not disclosed. Ultra rare products. 
188. Other. Well, there's Tavnios too, which is 80. And then other. Other 228. Total 8094. Oops, I'm looking at some of the wrong cells. There we go. Okay. 8151 total. So without obesity, which is the reason the stock's down, I guess, a lot today, what are we looking at? Non gap cost of goods 1454. Okay. R&D, 1440. We may actually choose to exclude that anyway. 1565, okay. Let's see. The market really didn't like the data, obviously. Even though this is a record revenue number for Amgen. Okay, taxes, 271, shares outstanding, 542. Okay, so let's take a look. So theoretically, at current stock price, which is 220 according to my sources, it's down quite a lot. There's a lot of debt. So the numerator is 173 billion. So at the very um, least, you've got with R&D expense, you've got 14 times. I know, Sardine, tell me about it. So that's with R&D expense. You've got 14 times earnings. And the growth is pretty pretty big, although the growth will lapse with the acquisition of um, Horizon. That'll lap next quarter. So theoretically, let's look at what that looks like. Okay, it's more like 4% without the Horizon deal. And then it's like basically no growth. So would you buy their no growth portfolio? Let's see. For yeah, call it four billion. So sixteen billion in cash flow a year, roughly. Would you buy their no growth portfolio for eleven times? That's excluding everything else in their pipeline. They don't have a lot in their pipeline. So is Amgen worth 11 times earnings? You know, Prolia is going to go biosimilar pretty soon. which is not good. Old Passaran. Yeah, there's nothing too exciting in this pipeline. Inhaled TSLP, that's actually a cool, cool idea. Oh. They are gonna launch a Ilea biosimilar, which is kind of neat. Yeah, the Ampton's okay. Got to think about it. 
doesn't jump off the page to me as that cheap. Oh, it's come, it's come back a bit today. Wow, it's not even too, it's not two twenty. It's two seventy five. Amjits had a big comeback today. I should have looked at it hours ago. I had grill. I had to deal with grill. Imagine catching that bottom at two fifty. Two fifty five. Buying call options. Amgen's actually recovered most of its damn losses. Hmm. Let's see, Regeneron. Well, I don't know about nosedive, but Yeah, Regeneron's been dropping for a while, I guess. I mean, I lay a biosimilar coming is is not great. But yeah, man, I'm I'm a little pissed I missed the Amgen buy, although not sure it was that great of a buy, but I would have liked to have nibbled on it. Micro strategy. Okay, I covered, I actually covered a decent amount of my short well, so I'm gonna reshort it. <laughs> Just back and forth. Uh, I'm very curious about Numora. They have data coming soon, and like the whole company is based on this, I think, based on their on this drug. So like, let's look at the model, I guess. Damn it. I keep buying it at the wrong price. Oopsie daisy. All right, NMRA Numora. It's like 10 bucks right now. Yeah. That's still a huge market cap. Okay, so they have $2 in cash. They don't really have anything else. Why wouldn't this put be worth a lot more? I don't know. Someone sell them to me. The J and J drug does seem to work, so that's one thing I'd say. So this could be a new class of medicines. It's not that obvious, so don't just go short it. Anyway, I've always used a Mac at work. They make me use one. I'm a programmer now, damn it. All right, Blackthorn Therapeutics, right? Isn't that who made this drug originally? Navicaprant? Yeah, the, the publication will be very important. Blackthorn Therapeutics. Okay, this was their J Medchem paper, so this is pretty huge.
they have a trans trans drug here. So that's the Pfizer drug I looked at earlier today. J&J &J had one? Uh, isn't that just a Lily one? Sammy Dorfin was, a, of course, a morphine derivative. The phase two for this never got published, which is really interesting. Six week trial? Yeah, I guess that's normal. Wait, why does it say recruiting? I thought this trial was over and we're getting the results. This is a different phase three. Maybe it keeps going for some reason. One dose. patients 332 that's a small study <laughs> it's not that small I guess but is that a second phase three how many how many of these are they running Results posted. Give me two seconds, guys.
Um, one second, guys. I'm just going to relocate for a second. I do need to pee. Man, micro strategy is this gift that keeps on giving. It's like a back and forth vol. It's just random noise, I guess, but so if Numora's trial fails and the drug doesn't work, hmm. One way to look at it is just make the assumption it doesn't work. Um favorite drug of all time is probably right toxin. It's definitely one of the most legendary. Drugs ever. Goaded, as some of you guys like to say. Oh, again with the fucking access denied. I'm really screwed from this freaking bastard browser. I have to do it from here? <laughs> <laughs> 